Tag, you're it. <laughs> hey, everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Tag Tuesday. And today we were tagged by Angie Lupus Life to do Dave's Tag. It has seven questions. You are dividing up the family assets. You can have the silver or the photos. Which do you take? Well, if it's real silver, I'd go for the silver. I would take the family photos because I'm used to not being rich anyway, so I'd rather have family photos of my mom and dad. But then you just get digital copies of all the photos. And then you find... But with my family, who knows? They might not give me copies. Only kidding. I love you all. Um, your son comes home with a snake. Do you let him keep it as a pet? Sure. Why? Why not? Um, I kind of liked Angie's answer to this, but I am going to have to say yes also. We've, we've had enough snakes around this house. Yeah. Your seven-year-old girl wants to play football. Do you let her? Sure. Tackle? I doubt if they have tackle football for seven-year-olds. Okay. Um, I would have to say yes also as long as it wasn't tackle football. Because I wouldn't say no to my son to do it. So, yeah, I couldn't say no to my daughter either. Okay. Pizza Man is here and you're normally and you normally tip a dollar. That's cheap. So there is, I think it's just an example. So now there is a dollar fee for debit cards. Do you still tip a dollar? Yeah. Yeah, it's not his fault that they are making debit cards go for a dollar. Or New pizza place, though. Yeah, or I would just, you know, even though we don't have cash, we never have cash on us, but if we had cash on us, we would pay cash for the pizza so that we wouldn't get that dollar fee. Um, your boss, okay, this is a good one for you, babe. Your boss does not like the teenage boy dressed like a girl in his store and wants you to kick him out. What do you do? First of all, I'm assuming that I'm, I work in a store. Okay. Uh, and being a human resource manager and knowing uh, these certain laws um, that a, for a, a store owner is a pretty stupid thing to do, um, I think I would quit. Me too. I would... Um... Kick your own son out. <laughs> Kick your own son out if he's dressing like a girl. I would have to say I would quit because I would tell my boss straight up that he's being prejudiced against an individual and or, or a type, stereotype, and I would walk off the job right then and there no matter how busy the store was or anything. Um, I wouldn't allow that. So, yeah, I would quit my job right then and there. You come across a drunk couple having sex in the parking lot. Do you film them and YouTube it, call the cops, or just leave? <laughs> just leave. Yeah, I would just leave and, you know, have fun. Bye. Um, and we'll leave it at that. And you're on a plane and someone is flipping out. Do you film <laughs> it? <laughs> Do you film it, just sit there, or try and help? I'd probably film that. Yeah. Because it's kind of like, you know, the, the, the things that go on on a plane. Um, if someone's flipping out, is someone actually flipping out or is uh, is the steward or stewardess doing something to make them flip out? Or So there's just so many horror stories nowadays on airplanes. I think it would be nice to have a little evidence. On the other hand, you got an airplane full of people. There's probably 42 uh, phones that just flipped out when it yeah. Something like that happens. Yeah. But, uh, I would be the type of person, um, it hasn't happened on a plane, but it has happened in other situations, where I would get involved and try and help to calm the situation down, um, try and help to calm the, the person that is flipping out down. Um, but that's just me. I, 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 um, I, I try and always help calm people down. So. I, don't, I wouldn't do that on a plane. Because they got sky marshals, and if someone starts flipping out, they'll probably handcuff them and turn the plane around, and you don't want to, I just don't think it'd be good to... 
But that's just in my nature. I don't know if I could just sit there. Uh, airplanes are nuts. Yeah. Being on an airplane is nuts. Know. Unless it's you're crazy. in that situation, I guess it's hard to really say what you would do. You know, but that concludes this episode of Tag Tuesday. We'll see you. Oh, we didn't tag anybody. Tag. Of course. Who do we, you're who, it. Who do we want to tag? Uh, let me think. Uh, uh, think, think real hard. <laughs> okay, let me look down our list. How about we tag Meet the Presleys? I haven't tagged them in anything, I don't think. Ooh. What? Okay. Okay. Meet the Presleys, Dana B. Saw, and a tag, a, a two-person tag, Katie Caroline and her brother Rex 25059. So tag, you're it. And we will see you next week on another episode of Tag Tuesdays.